Hey guys, and welcome back to Western in the Wilderness. This is episode 3, and we have a lot of new friends here. Uh, there's James, there's Al, and I think I'm gonna name you... Squidward. I know, it's random, but... Anyways, I took a sleep in that bed, and I think we're gonna head out and begin our adventure. Now, I was thinking about, um, going to that jungle, but... I decided we do a little more spelunking first because um, I want to gain a few resources before I uh, actually head out and um, as you can see my inventory is pretty full um, I collected a few leaves and those aren't really important right now so I'm gonna just leave them here and then probably I'm gonna either come back for them or just leave them but I'm going to stow away some of the stuff. Um, hmm. Because we are going spelunking. And actually, I'll take that and I'll leave that. Um, I'll leave the mushrooms. I'll leave the apples. I'll leave half the seeds here. Um, I'll leave the wool, bring enough for a bed, and I'll leave that stuff as well. Yeah, so this looks good. Um, I'll even leave a few of that because I'm probably gonna find a lot of coal when we uh, head down there. I'm gonna make a few torches, and we are pretty much set. Oh, hi there. Um, sorry about that. Uh, have fun rebuilding your house. Uh, yeah, I feel bad now. <laughs> um, but anyways, where is that cave? Somewhere over here towards the, uh, jungle. I don't know where the jungle is now. Uh-oh. Well, it's over there. Alright. So hopefully they rebuild their house. I don't know if they can do that, but hopefully they do because my goodies are in there and uh, I feel kind of bad that their house got destroyed. Oh well, they'll have uh, they'll have something to do finally. Ooh, leg spike there. That could have been bad. Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna do this spelunking thing. I want to use out my uh, wooden pick because I'm probably never gonna use it again. And that's right, you now gain experience from mining these ores. I am playing in 1.3. And, um, so far it's been a blast, actually. Um, I'm enjoying a few of the new 1.3 stuff. Um, they're not really new to me because of, uh, that video I did of explaining most of the major changes for 1.3. If you haven't seen that already, you can check it out. Um,. But yeah, it's really cool, like, uh, this experience that you get from mining ores is really cool. You don't get it from mining iron, but, like, redstone, uh, lapis, diamond, coal, stuff like that. Stuff that you, uh, don't need to, uh, smelt, I suppose would be the most accurate thing. And I'll just cover that up. Alright, so let's get started here. want to light up this areas so um if we decide to make a, a mob spawner we can do that and have a uh, maximum i'll probably come back for this um but yeah if we make a mob spawner i want to have maximum oh what's this oh this is gravel it's a new texture so we can have a maximum spawn rate there we go <laughs> um thought i was never gonna get that one out uh yeah we'll just put a torch there and I think my pick is pretty much done, so definitely shouldn't be too much longer <laughs> that you guys have to uh, grind through this stupid wooden pick in its four hour digging time. I think this is the last one. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so um, I'm hoping to get a lot of iron. I want to try and make some uh, iron armor and stuff. Um, not really looking for diamond yet, 
but if it's there, I'll take it. <laughs> First, I'm gonna need a diamond pick, and then, um, I'm pretty sure I need five, two diamonds after that to make the, uh, chanting table, and then any diamond we find after that, we're gonna have to leave. And, hang on. And, yeah, um, sorry about that, I was, uh, just went to get a glass of water. Um, but yeah, I think I'll come back to mine this, but, uh, no, nah, actually, I'll just, I'll just grab it here so, uh, I don't get anything in the comments. Oh, you left coal. Oh, you left, uh, the iron there. Um, so far I haven't gotten anything like that, thankfully, but that's probably because I've mined everything I've seen. So, <laughs> we'll see. Um, hmm. What else is there to talk about? Um, this update's pretty exciting, actually. Um, I'm looking forward to the uh, new adventure mode. Probably do a let's play on that. Ooh, iron. Goody. Four iron, maybe? Four, five, six? Nah, it's just four. That's alright. I'm liking this new... Erg. I'm liking this new uh, gravel texture. It's pretty neat. Um, I was a bit confused when I first saw him, like, wait, there's a new block, and then, nope, it's gravel. <laughs> okay, so this is the direction we definitely want to go. We want to go down. And, ooh, I don't like this. Uh, I suppose we'll just go this way. And it's a dead end. That's perfect. Um... Yeah, that should be enough. Let's just sort out our inventory here. Uh, yeah, that's good. That's good. <clears throat> oh, here's some iron. Didn't even see that on the ceiling. I hear a zombie. Um, probably above us. So I don't want to dig up too much, but grabbing these ores should be fine. Um, I think I'll leave the rest because I'm gonna want to come back when I get a I'm gonna get a fortune pick if I ever get have the fortune of getting a fortune pick, pun intended. <laughs> um. Or should I just grab it? Yeah, I'll just grab it and then we'll probably find a lot more deposits of coal anyways and once you get a fortune pick you're pretty much set for coal and then I want to see if I can try and make a blaze rod blaze farm um, from what I've seen in the videos it's lots of redstone and uh, not very good at redstone but I'll give it a shot and um, I'm probably gonna make a mob tower or something. Um, that'll help us get prepared for the uh, Ender Dragon. I don't plan on uh, just facing the Ender Dragon and ending this world. I wanna do a lot of things in this world. Um, but uh, I definitely wanna try and get that dragon egg because uh, I've never done it before because the one time I did face the Ender Dragon, I kind of forgot to bring a piston and redstone torch, and yeah, that didn't really that didn't really work when I broke it. <laughs> um, but yeah, hopefully this time I'll remember. Um, can I get up here? Yeah, we, yeah. All right. Um, <laughs> nothing really big on the hockey front. Um. There's a new stick line coming out for the Easton Stealth line. I don't know if many of you saw it, but it's pretty sick. Easton's a really good, um, really good company. I use Easton sticks when I play. So, um, yeah, definitely check them out. Um, all right, what's up here? Probably nothing. Um, eventually I'm gonna want to come out and dig all this, uh, gravel up, but for now it's probably fine. 
now what is there to do? Oh, it looks like it's becoming night again. So that's probably an episode right there. <laughs> I didn't even realize how uh, fast that time flew by there. Um, but yeah, it looks like the sun is setting. And uh, we're probably going to have to finish the spelunking another time. But uh, yeah, that was a pretty uneventful episode. Ooh, that's weird. I've never seen sand and snow together in a biome. Ooh, what's this? Oh, I think this might be our next few episodes right here, boys. Yeah, <laughs> these caves look unreal. Um, anyways. Oh, no, 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 no. That was not good. That was not good at all. Anyways, <laughs> thanks for tuning in, boys. Um, definitely sauce me a subscription and a like if you like the video. Um, if you don't, let me know why. Provide me with some feedback. Um, I'm always trying to improve my videos. And um, I know this one was kind of uh, oh, they didn't rebuild the house. What's wrong with you guys? I'm gonna have to move out now. All right, guys, we're moving out. We can do one last thing in this episode. We're moving out. I don't want your garbage. Alright. Let's grab up all the items here. And head on it. Oh, and I can take the chest. My chest. Not your chest. My chest. And I'm going to take this too. Might as well just eat this bread. Alright. If I die here, this... I, I don't know. I only. Uh, oh, this is a very nice house. Lighting glitch. Uh, maybe once we clear out the wilderness from here, we'll make this a home. Looks pretty empty, actually, so. Ta da! This is our new home, boys. Uh, home sweet home. And I'm gonna lay down a furnace and a workbench. And I don't like it there though. Um, where should I move it to? Alright, I'm gonna have to, we're gonna have to call in the, uh, call in the interior designer. Um, hmm, where do I want it? I guess, I guess here wouldn't be bad. Oh, we don't have a door, do we? No, we don't. Well, I have plenty of wood, so. Don't like wasting it, but door is probably necessary. And then we're gonna have to make another chest, I would think. Oh, that was a failed click. <laughs> oh, man. Hey! What the heck? This door is like tripping out. Yeah, it's all your fault, isn't it? Oh my goodness. Okay. Your name is, uh... Hmm. I don't know what your name is gonna be. Let me know in the comments what you want to name that... That dude over there. Um, but yeah, thanks for tuning in, guys. Um, I know this was a pretty boring episode, actually. I, I didn't really have that much fun... Uh, playing this one, it was mainly just blunking and stuff, but at least we found a new home, boys. That's definitely something cool that we've done in this episode, and we've made a new friend, or is that Al, or... Holy crap, 17 raw chicken, where the... What do you think I am, Rich? No, get out of here. Get out of here. Okay, I know what you're gonna, what you're gonna be called, uh... Richie McRich. Alright, get out of here. Get out of here. Alright, see you guys later. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in. You, my friend, are a joke. Get out of here. Fine. Oh, you brought friends. <laughs> well, let's get to the start this party right here. Nah, oh, you guys are no fun.